All too often, it feels as though life is out of control. It's something we all go through from time to time. This crazy mixed up world seems to be hurtling through space completely out of control. In fact, not even the things in our lives seem to be under our control. One of the greatest problems in today's world is that we've managed to develop quite a distorted view of the relationship that we have between God and ourselves. The problem seems to be that we want to be equal with God, to be in control of everything. We want God to dance to our tune. We, we want him to deliver what we want when we want. And when things don't play themselves out that way, when it hurts longer than it should, when it takes longer than it should, when it doesn't head in the right direction the way that it should, life feels as though it's out of control. Some people think that to be a Christian, you have to be kind of this meek and my little mouse, that you have to live in a doormat existence. But just have a chomp on this bit of God's word for a minute. Psalm 8 verses 3 to 8. When I look at your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and the stars that you have established, what are human beings that you are mindful of them, mortals that you care for them? Yet you have made them a little lower than God and crowned them with glory and honour. You have given them dominion over the works of your hands. You have put all things under their feet. And sure, some things are out of our control. The heavens, the moon, the stars, completely out of our control. But just get a grip on this for a moment. God has given us, God has given you dominion over the works of his hands. So when you get up tomorrow morning, okay, perhaps not everything in your life is just as you'd like it to be. But you don't have to be a victim to those things because there's a whole bunch of things that God has already put under your control. The works of his hands, for starters. So when life feels as though it's careering out of control, it's time to grab a hold of the things that are under your control. Maybe that's as simple as tidying up your home, having a shower and putting on some clean clothes so that you feel better about yourself and your surroundings. When life's out of control, grab a hold of those things that are within your control and get them heading in the right direction. Because the rest, the rest will surely follow. That's God's word, fresh for you today.